party people. <clears throat> it is a day, a day of racing, a day of making sure we have our mustache comb because the stash is getting cray cray, you guys. I am going racing. I should have been gone like a long time ago, but I freaking sat around my house looking at my fucking shoes for like a solid 45 minutes. Uh, I got my first shot for my, uh, what is it, the vaccination shot for COVID. Shut up, car. And uh, while I don't feel sick or anything, I definitely feel tired. But that could have been because I don't get enough sleep, you know what I mean? Uh, so yeah, we're on our way to the track. Going to be great. Going to be fun. Going to be great. I need some coffee and something to eat because I am a spacey space cadet of spaciness right now. And nobody likes that. So much talking. Um, looks like the directions didn't take me down by the Starbucks, so I'm gonna grab a sandwich from Starbucks. Use any lane to turn left onto University Boulevard West. Shut your whore mouth. University Boulevard West for one and a half. Yeah, I'm gonna stop at Starbucks, grab a sandwich and a coffee, and then head out. I'll see you guys there. All right, here we are inside the track. Look, everybody's mostly here already. And, uh, yeah, it's good to set up. People are practicing, I need to practice. Got to get all my gear out, do all that fun stuff. Brian can go fix his transponder. Yeah, my car's now. It should be, it should be uh, two minutes, 10 seven. minutes upon the conclusion of this race. <laughs> Meanwhile, Mike's still in the lead. Lamont second. Brian third and out. Multiple car takedown. Unfortunately, it appears that Mike, uh, sorry, Brian hit the wrong car right there as he sends a teammate on the lid. The Toyota body started looking a little bit twisted right there from all the rollovers. Quite a bit of rollovers in this compared to the previous one. The mod goes around right there. That's going to hand over some time to Mike. Maybe I think it's like go. some of the glue is getting inside of my car. All three cars still running now, two laps apart to each other, nice and easy, and I have a serious right arm hit thanks to cracking Brian's car. Lovely. Fortunately, they are as they run on the track One right left. here. Mike Lamont and Brian. Brian, the only the only driver running a many a proper manufacturer body in this heat. Oh my goodness, Lamont parked it on top of the wall and I had actually forgotten that we had, oh wait a minute, we had a marshal there, it's just a little slow on that draw. You want to, uh, Megan, stay here. Stay on the inside. Funny noise from the pit. I guess someone's doing a motor test or something. All three cars still going, we've got 19 seconds left in this race. Oh, all right, my right, right. oh, crap, I don't feel bad. Right away. Oh, All right, he's going again. 10, 9 seconds left to go. This one is going to time out. Keep going. Keep going, driver. This is over. All righty, should be finished on this next time by. One time. Brian, you're done. Lamont, you're, you're done. Mike, done. you are done. Thank you, Racers and Marshals. Mike takes a Lamont second, Brian third. It's good. Try that. Um, it's better. It's a lot. It's, it's, a, it's a lot freer. So it shouldn't vibrate like it does. Okay. If it does, I would recommend taking the glue off the rears. Off the rears. Yeah. Okay. So. Well, thank you very much, sir, Mark. Oop. It should be better. All right. So he just helped me out with my GLA V2. Thank you very much. I will try this out in the next race. Woo! I'm gonna go outside and smoke.
and Mike has just gotten by Brian for second, and Lamont's about to lap both of them. And indeed he has, Lamont in full control of this race as the Bittners are battling it out. Brian is temporarily taking second back from Mike, and then Mike takes it back from Brian, and then, oh, Brian just got by Mike after Mike had a rollover. Thanks. Back and forth battle for second as Lamont has a lap on the field. Mike's facing the wrong way for some reason. Fortunately, he's able to get that car going straight again. Oh, Lamont rolls it. Brian can make up some time on him, and he has. Brian's starting to make up some time slowly, but surely on Lamont right there. One minute, five, two, go. Oh, Mike two wheels it into the wall and rolls it. One minute left. One minute to go, one minute left in this race. It's the final race of the round before you can all take a break, myself included. So Mike has laid down a 7-7-3, seven, seven, the fastest lap of this race so far. Brian and Mike battling it out for second. Brian getting the upper hand so far. And he's the only one of those two that is the closest to Lamont, although Lamont just appears poised to take another lap away from Brian, and indeed he has. Whoa, Brian hits that wall out of time. He keeps that Lexi and Toyota going. And change your position right here. Mike is briefly taking second from Brian. Actually, that would take second from Brian indefinitely this time by. Indeed he has. Brian takes it right back from him on corrected time. Five seconds left to go, driver. This one is coming to an end. Keep going, keep going. Keep going, driver. No one is done yet. Lamont, you are done. We'll take the win. Wait on the Bittner family to finish this one out. Mike's done. Brian's done. Mike takes second. Brian third on corrected time. Thank you, racers and Mark. What do you, what do you, what do you think of that one? We will resume. It's 309 right now. We will resume at 319. All right, so making it to the first uh, sportsman class race. Vlad Mio, sorry. But uh, she, did, she, she did it. It happened. Yeah. Yeah, and she made it to the end, and uh, next time she'll uh, have a little practice and try it again. It was fun. It was a good time. So, uh, he is set to lap Saint a second time. Ooh, Saint bounced off the wall real bad right there. It's like then Mark starting to eat up, realizing he's got nearly a two lap lead on the whole field. As it does appear that Saint has started to find some ground, and Dee has found some. He found a little something right there as he laid down seven cars that last lap. But then Denmark goes and lays down a 7 3. Saints just can't catch a break right there on timing and scoring. Lamont spins it right there in front of the field. And Denmark is still trying to lap Saint a second time. My goodness, he is not content. Up the street. With Clear. winning by a lap. Who wants to win by all the laps right here? He is dropping, throwing Saint down. Hunting him down with two minutes to go. Denmark wanting total control and he's about to get it. If he can complete this, well, he completes the pass all right. It bounces off Saint, knocking him on his lid. That would be two laps to hit Denmark two. Saints, Denmark two up on Saints. Oh my goodness, total domination up there by that white pony bag. Why was the orange stripe pony bag? In the next bracketed race, we'll be the last man standing for, uh, for whoever we have running this one. I will give you guys an extra five minutes. Like, you get five minutes to, from last minute entries, and then after that, we are starting. One ten to go. Denmark two laps on the shake. field. He's about to make it three. Guys are so fast. My hands are shaking. Timing is going to he's on pace that? to make it three. Oh, he's made it three. Six parked it in the wall again. Denmark with three laps up on Saint. Fifty seconds to go. 
Is that Denmark going to have, let Saint have that lap? Oh, Finn's bouncing off the wall, so I'll take that as a no. Coming up on the final, 30 seconds left to go. 30 seconds to go, Denmark spins, but time and story says he still has that third lap to himself. Whack. Well then. What a loud noise. 20 seconds to go, not 10, that's coming up very soon. Coming up on the final 10 seconds to go. Denmark now with a three lap lead over the field. Denmark in total control of this one. Oh, yeah, Lamont parks it on the wall, right in front of the camera, yeah, too. Saying you are done. I'm waiting on the rest of the field. Denmark takes the job, and, so, and Lamont takes third. That is mod A, and that is the <laughs> All right, so there you go. That was a race day, and uh, races happened. I got first place in the B, B and then I just then I got third place in the A main which makes sense think there's only three racers in it <laughs> and uh, I think I got my cars pretty much help, uh, hooked up Denmark helped me out on uh, a couple setups um, running a slightly looser spring in the rear on my GLR GT which is pretty cool I may try to loosen up some other parts of it but I, I kind of like the way it, it rolls it's just Everything changes when I bring it home to my home track, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that. Anyways, thanks for watching, you guys, and I will see you guys in the next one. Eyeballs are going gibbledy good because I have not eaten anything. I had a breakfast sandwich that made me ill, and then uh, I decided not to eat anything for the rest of the day. So I'll see you guys in the next one. And, you know, like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next video. God knows when that's going to be because I have not edited anything in quite some time. So I will see you guys later. Click on the, this is the side that has the videos and subscribe on the circle that probably is going to be over top of Megan's face possibly, but maybe down here. I don't know. And uh, yeah, keep it easy and easy. It's 20 seconds to the end. 20 seconds.